In a major announcement during the FANDEF 2025 defense exhibition, aerospace innovator Destinus and Spanish technology giant Grupo Asia revealed a strategic alliance aimed at co-developing cutting-edge long-range missile systems. This newly formalized partnership centers on producing advanced surface-to-surface -surface strike platforms for military applications, beginning with the operational Ruta missile. The Ruta missile, currently active and field-tested, serves as the first joint product under this cooperation. It's equipped with a high-performance guidance, navigation, and control, GNC, suite developed by UAV Navigation, a company under Grupo Asia. This system was designed and assembled entirely within Spain, reflecting the country's growing self-sufficiency in advanced defense technology. Built with a focus on versatility and adaptability, the Ruta platform incorporates modular features including a customizable payload compartment, detachable wings for compact storage, and a turbojet engine. Its architecture supports precision engagement in environments where satellite navigation is disrupted or denied. With a cruise velocity of Mach 0.8 and a range stretching to 500 km, the Ruta is a potent loitering munition that blends UAV capabilities with missile performance. The projectile is launched via a rocket booster and uses optical guidance for pinpoint accuracy during its final approach, achieving a 15 square meter circular error probable CEP. Grupo Asia's proprietary GNC technology ensures the missile maintains mission integrity even under intense electronic interference, employing autonomous targeting and robust anti-spoofing measures. The system's combat readiness has been tested in real-world battlefield conditions. This partnership not only aims to optimize the Ruta system for Spain's military needs but also targets global export markets. The agreement is underpinned by support from the Spanish Ministry of Defense, aligning with broader NATO objectives and encouraging greater participation of domestic industry in the defense supply chain. Grupo Asia CEO Luis Fernals emphasized that this collaboration cements his company's leadership in precision weapon systems, while Destinus founder Mikhail Kokorich pointed to the need for agile, responsive development cycles informed by recent conflicts. Destinus Spain CEO, Placido Marquez, added that their model balances vertical integration with multinational cooperation. The Ruta has already seen use on the battlefield. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky referenced the missile in December 2024 while discussing indigenous weapons capabilities. Though technical specifics were withheld, it was confirmed that Ukrainian forces had received and tested the system in combat. Observers at the Eurosatory 2024 event identified a displayed airframe marked with Ukrainian insignia as the Ruta, featuring its distinctive cylindrical body, fixed wings, and tri-fin tail configuration. Destinus has acknowledged supplying Ukraine with multiple UAVs, including the Ruta, Lord, and Hornet systems. In its reconnaissance version, the Ruta drone features a reusable design with parachute and airbag-assisted recovery. A vertical landing capability is in development. These drones are built in facilities across Germany, Spain, and the Netherlands, with expansion plans for local production in Ukraine. The Ukrainian deployed variant reportedly has a reduced range of 300 km but retains the system's hallmark cost efficiency and low altitude flight capabilities. Since mid 2023, Destinus has been delivering over 100 drones monthly to Ukrainian forces. The Ruta system's modularity extends to all core components. The airframe supports quick payload swaps depending on mission requirements. Its avionics suite is hardened against jamming and tailored for electronic warfare resilience. With a takeoff weight below 300 kg, a length of 3.93 meters, and a wingspan of 2.25 meters, the missile is engineered for maximum operational flexibility. In addition to strike missions, the platform is adaptable for ISR, intelligence, surveillance, reconnaissance, emergency resupply, and training roles. Destinus, founded in 2021 by Kokorich and originally based in Switzerland, now operates out of France and runs additional facilities in Madrid, Munich, and Hengelo. The company specializes in dual-use aerospace systems, including propulsion and high-speed aerial vehicles. One of Destinus' more ambitious projects involves the development of hydrogen-fueled hypersonic aircraft, though its present revenues have largely been driven by UAV exports. 
The firm posted under 20 million euros in revenue in 2023, with significantly higher projections for 2024 due to increased defense contracts. During FANDEF 2025, both companies jointly showcased the RUDA and its full system suite. The missile was presented as a cost-effective, combat-proven solution, optimized for modern warfare's multi-domain requirements and electronic warfare challenges. Marketing materials emphasized the modular construction, precision navigation, and swarming potential of future variants. Destinus also confirmed plans to enhance recovery mechanisms and develop versions with autonomous engagement capability for next-generation operations.